his back, trying to stay alive. Sensor's gonna get him. Sensor, that's a huge kill on Crim6. Time is ticking away. And Sensor is just completely baiting out Optic Gaming here. The crowd chanting Doug. Shots going down, no one dying. Sensor backing up to some support. That was a huge play, but Slasher has gone down. That's Nature with the kill. Three versus three. Time is ticking. Oh, Sensor! He just got a kill. Oh, okay, by a second! Sensor! Unbelievable play! That leaves Nature one on three. He's going to get the kill, though. 29 seconds left. Bomb down. Can he stay alive? Nature, no! They win the championship! Sensor, an unbelievable play. What a comeback! FaZe had to do it twice, two best of fives. Off. Yeah, I think it's about to say GG. Up to gaming are your UMG Orlando grand champions. But Blake's is gonna score for two, but it honestly doesn't matter. Phenomenal plays from Optic here in the grand final. And to be honest, the crowd chanting, yeah, it's all over. Yeah, the crowd chanting, it's all over. It, it is all over, and it's been over for a while. When Optic Gaming managed to just get 10 points in two minutes and, and like 34 seconds, how do you expect a team to reply to that? You just simply can't. The players have stopped. Optic, start the high fives in the booth, Matt. And Optic Gaming, as we said, your UMG Orlando Grand Champion. Oh, Fade is just lighting on up here between blue and red. The shouts are coming out from the players as well, but it is looking like it's Mind Freak able to hit that 200 point mark first with 30 seconds remaining. These guys in there, and this is the most contested hill on hard point by a lab, and they all knew that going into this one right there. 19 seconds is the scoreline difference. They can't break the contestion. That is going to be it. Mind Freak do take it out. 15 seconds still to go. The T1 guys are aware of it. They know, or I believe they all know by now that they can't come back, but they're still going to play. They're still going to finish this map out. They're not going to stop, as will Mind Freak. They will wrap this one up, and they'll find out who will finish up better off in regards to scores. They're just going to tap those KDs, so to speak. 39 kills for fighter. I think it's 206 to 182. Mind Freak Plantronics are your Call of Duty Asia Pacific champions here. And they've continued to do it here. Optic Gaming not done until the final seconds. You can see the focus still on these players' faces. They don't want to allow this flag coming in from replays. Replays, though, will be able to convert one. No! no. <laughs> I am a liar, Ben. No, they, they'll, they'll get one. Don't All worry. right, there J we go. The JCap will put it in. Your final score should be 40, or excuse me, 4-2, just one as I looked up, and it's going to be Crim6 on top of the kill feed once say. again, 29 and 22. That good pocket. He said Crimbot would be here today <laughs> in the grand finals, and he really showed up uh, in all three games. He turned up so well. I mean, he was very disappointed with himself. Up to gaming in their second title here in Advanced Warfare. And um, interestingly speaking to Hector, he said he didn't actually count MLG, he came to the MLG Championship. This was the one he was looking for for the squadron. Swanee and Josh in the opposing team's base. Gunchy, he's going to pull this one out. I'm not a fan of the way that Epson is playing this. They tried to rotate back. They didn't really commit to it. Going to have not 24 seconds left, and it's going to be Tommy. He needs to pull this one out back towards that flag. I think he should just try and challenge this player. He's going to have one in front. He's going to be he's able to get that one away. out. And he's got it away. He's going to bring this down low towards the spawners. It's a very nice flag route. Right, Tommy? All he needs to do is hold on to this. It's going to be Moose, really the last chance for TCM. Moose gets one. He's going to see Tommy there, and he's got players against him. Well, he is outnumbered. He's looking for it. He is going to go down. No players there for the team of TCM. And Epsilon will be the European champion for Mad Cat. It's the second time in as many years. Big play, 10 to the last second. What a final end. Yep. Play the drone. You know, do that a couple of times. You're going to win the game. A replay's just got a three-piece grenade. How much of an impact is that going to be? All four players fall, and the drone in Clayster's hand. They need to go for a two-point play here. They need to try and slay out. You see, they're now pushing, but Scumpy and Form will pick up two kills. Now maybe just go for the one. And uh, that's unfortunate, because if replay hits that three-piece, you, you can't need to convert that. 25 seconds left. Replay's trying to go for a two. They needed a two and a one. And it, like they were trying to go for the one. That's uh, right, the two on that play, and unfortunately, not going to be able to connect it. The drone has reset, but 15 seconds left. Not going to be enough time to convert a two and a one. So Optic Gaming will be your North American Call of Duty 2015 champions. Give it up for Optic Gaming. Only dropping the one game to phase all weekend long, proving they are the top team at Call of Duty, dominating North America. I don't want to say anything. <laughs> and there come the kill. J-Cap didn't present to attach as well. So two on three in favor of Denial. However, of course, Denial do need to fuse that bomb. 20 seconds left. 
Replay. Another. It all comes down to Facento here. The bomb getting confused. Oh, Attach is on it. He's on it. Facento. He's gonna fall. And Attach is gonna get the defuse. Oh, Ladies oh, and gentlemen, oh, your winners for the 2015 Call of Duty Championship. What a job by Denial. They hold strong, men. They lock it down on Riot. The prison is theirs. Now, Team Caliber have 45 seconds to get a capture or else this game is over. That is something crazy. That's basically one push. If you mess up your first push, this game is over. Now, Envy do not want to turn on their base because if they all get dropped, they're, no, they're going to have no chance in coming back into this one. Start with the flank. You could have a pull right go. here. Pierre side with the flank. He has a pull, oh. but he's going to be taken out by Merc. Merc's push kill might have just sealed the deal for Envious to win this map, but Gunjar there to clean up the slack. Gets the flag pull of his own, turning around the corner. Up all the grenades! Proofy with a clutch two-piece right there could have That's... just saved the game again for Team Envious. Here we go, Team trying to stop the clock. Seven seconds left. It might be able to happen. We're going into the final seconds. Two seconds left. He has to exo in. Don't get stuck oh, on the wall. He gets no! it! No! TK! Get the... Oh my god! How much time? He had... That was that was less than half a second right there that flag cap happened. Oh my goodness, that was insane. TK There's with no the way. clutch counter cap in oh overtime. Oh my god. B3, and there's only one player in a position to stop it. I think they're going to get this flag out, and this is going to be a He needs to get, to get out. He's going to get shut down. No! Just the tiniest to stop, but Scum will now rip it away. Players come through lobby for him. If he can tip out here, he might be able to get his home. No, he should be a 3-3. He's going to get this one home. Nobody able to stop him as he has put it back now. 3-3, 30 seconds left to go. This screams overtime. Or does it? Both teams are going to pull this away. Krim is pulling. Optic have a good chance now to shut this one down. Formal with a two-piece. Crimson has the opportunity to run this one home. The dying seconds of this game, I don't see Cali Cup going in. It is going to go home. Oh Optic Gaming will bring this all the way back in the final dying seconds. And that's going to be all she wrote, ladies and gentlemen. Optic Gaming are your ESWC champions. Oh, what a game! Well, never count them out, boys. You see, just look at the sheer look of relief, I think, on all their faces that they managed to pull that out within the final few seconds. Formal able to pick up one. Apathy and window. He's about to get pushed. He gets that gunfight. He gets away. He gets away. And it's two versus two here. 25 seconds on the clock, Pricey. They have to do something now. Commit. Go to a bomb site and commit. That's only opportunity they have. This could all be over in just a second. It's gone down. It's now Apathy in a one versus two. It's going to be all over. There it is. Optic Gaming. Optic Gaming will take this down to one of the most tensest things we've ever seen. I'll tell you what, man, you don't have Krim on your team, you do not win this game. Five <laughs> big play after big play. Holy mother of God, by the one of final. As a prime time player, fuck it. I mean, this guy has made every big play imaginable for FaZe in this series. I don't think there's any question he belongs you know, with some of the best players in the game. You see why he is such a highly sought after player. Everyone fighting for him when all the trades are going down. Off the break, formal oh, no. clearing the way, and there is the toss. That is going to be a very difficult time for FaZe to beat. We've actually seen TR, they run a very interesting play where they'll send a guy back alley from the same side that FaZe is on. So they'll send one back alley and then they have another guy go middle and they try and pass it to him through the back alley. It's you see FaZe though, train. they're going to fight this straight up from the front. They don't win these gun battles at the start, it's all game. And the satellite is taken! Karma can't get it out of the map! It's tossed in the back of the face base and Optic Gaming will be crowned your UMG California champions. Yeah, that is such a tough time to beat an OT. We return, a big play comes in for face and that was Zuma who just directly jumped on the flag but with 36 seconds, Zuma making a huge play in the enemy base, looking for a three piece, has him weak. Sasha's pulled the flag, Zuma with the third, can he find the fourth? Zuma, unbelievable play from him, trying to chase down Crimson. The flag has still been pulled out by Slasher. He's away with 24 seconds, they need to kill the optic flag carrier. Yeah, FaZe needs to just flood the optic base. Slasher thinking about going back, trying to challenge that player. I think he probably has to at this moment in time. It's going to be optic just playing defense around Crim6. Crim6 going huge here in the last 30 seconds of CT. Oh, who for the kill, know? not able to get a return. Nobody in position for phase, it looks like, Ben. And that is going to be that optic gaming back to back X Games gold medalist. Scumpy with his second gold.
Unbelievable performance once for Optic. He needs to get inside yellow, and it's all two. of phase needs to be spawned inside of green. They need to play these last 30 seconds absolutely flawlessly if they want to have a chance to I force I don't think OT. they're going to be able to do it. Enable has the drone. If he plays this for 15, this is basically GG, oh. but no, he does go down. Drone still alive. I believe Optic Gaming may be able to get it. it. It's still down. Common needs to pick it up. 22 seconds left. He's going to go down. There. If phase can just pick it up and play for 15, it will be GG. There's only 15 seconds left in, and Optic needs to go for two two-point plays. Formal's going to die, and that looks as if it's going to be that. Karma, last man up. FaZe are going to take the UMG Dallas Grand Final 3-0 in the first best of five. And Enable's going to let you know about getting it. getting hyped. FaZe Clan only dropping two maps throughout the entire weekend. Honestly, just looking dominant, Benson. A lot of rounds to work with. Yeah, you can throw something unconventional in and already worry Clan's about it. going to pick up one, though. Huge play right there for that first blood. Well, it's all been traded away again. It's numerical advantage to phase. Now it's a two versus two. Zuma and attach. It's a oh. two v one, actually, Bryce. It's oh, gonna be Karma Karma last one alive. That's it. And that is it. Phase gonna win your summer 100k championship for Gfinity. A massive comeback, down three one overall in the series. Oh, that is a shocking comeback right there. Looked like Optic Gaming in complete control. And then phase just the momentum too strong there at the end. All apart for the Wolfpack. 38 seconds remaining. Formal oh. trying to run this drone. Optic Gaming want to put the nail in the coffin. So they have that drone in school, and this could be it. 29 seconds left. Oh, if Optic Benson, can get this, Doug Denal's in trouble. They get it. 11 to 8 with 25 seconds left. This is essentially just a victory lap now for Optic Gaming as they try and pepper as many bullets into the Denial place as they possibly can. But three plays do go down. It could still technically be possible. Hook with the drone. 12 seconds left. He's going to need to go quickly. Hits the beat down. They need a one or two. Nine seconds left. That is going to be it. Optic Gaming, your UMG DC champions. They pick up their eighth Advanced Warfare title. Unbelievable Dominant. plays Dominant. from Optic Gaming. You see the celebrations in the booth, the high fives, and the handshakes coming from that the OG. And you see the train coming through. Phase setting up, and it's gonna be Zuma punishing Karma on that perimeter. Looking at Formal. He's, Scumpy does pick up a kill though. 3v3, Krim trying to trade that kill, needs to be careful because there's so many explosive barrels. He does manage to get away, two versus three though, in favor of FaZe. Formal sneaks behind one, makes it a two versus two. Formal and Krim going up against Attach and Zuma. 56 seconds left in the round and Formal is being desperately chased. He needs to be careful here because both players from FaZe are right on his tail. Formal surely dead to rights, Attach. Oh, don't get turned on, surely oh. not. No, picks up the kill, now a oh, one versus Krim. two. The shot car in a 1v2, 39 seconds remain, and Krim is going to get finished. FaZe will take your Season 3 championship. And wow, what a road they took to the finals. They're able to finish Optic not once, but twice. We opened up. I think it, it may be that he's left. Um, in all honesty, whilst it's not mathematically impossible, it's pretty much mm. getting to that stage at this point. And uh, I, I think Millennium fact, are going to be aware of done. it. He's done. There was 120 points to to gather. You know, two minutes, 120. And they're over 120. They're 130 behind. So, all right. Well, congratulations that, to Vitality. I, I mean, we're going to see it through. We can see Joe and Tommy still playing this all the way. Poor uh, Swanee. Swanee was about to hit a 50 bomb. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> he, he would have got that, I'm we, sure. We've had no signals when this game as of yet. So, for, as far as we're aware, it's still continuing. Guitar and Moose aren't actually playing this through. It looks like it's, it looks like it is just going to be Mad Cat actually, yeah. who's just making sure that those final points go towards Vitality. And there we go. That is going to be it. Vitality take the victory. It is going to be a 3-1 lead again in the series. Vitality back to back 3-1. So now on the attacking side, Scumpy being aggressive straight off the bat. Formal is going to be calling out a couple of players, pushing. First blood is huge in this round. If Optic Gaming get it, Denial's back is truly going to be against the wall. And you can see lots of shots going down. Formal again unable to connect with the kill. Still yet to see the first blood. There it is, coming in from Crip. Four versus three now. In favor of Optic Gaming, 60 seconds left on the clock. Denial know they have to push. Formal's going to be essentially lining up for him. Picked up one, trade did come in from Tap. Stun, hitting Formal, Formal forced to back up. Karma trying to back him up here with a sniper, but not the angle he wanted. Krim, 10 kills already. Is he gonna find number 11? Big kill comes in for Karma. It's essentially a 1v3 for Temp. Tournament life on the line, and he goes down. 
Optic Gaming has done it again, Ben. FaZe caused a few problems in the last championship match, but here against it now, they will not let it go to a second series. They will close it out 4-1 in the final best of